still on question 2 a eh? what we now reach part 2 of that question what you have here is 3x over 4y cubed divided by 21x squared or divide over 20y squared now you remember when you have this fraction divided by another fraction you remember the shortcut it's this fraction it is the one on the left is the numerator which is, would be on top and this part the denominator at the bottom of the fraction so it's really a fraction over a fraction if you look at it now remember what to do when you have when you're using the shortcut method here you have 3 x over 4 y cube this become multiply you multiply by then you will find the reciprocal of the second fraction so it's really this over this that's what you're getting right so you're going to put this at the top and this at the bottom you will find the reciprocal so what you have is 20 y squared over 21 x squared all right Let me get rid of these so what happens now you have x up here and you have an x square down here and you say x into x square goes what you could do it that way but let me just expand it out a bit to make it a bit clearer at the top you have 3x over 4 y cube when you say y cube it means y by y by y so 3 y's multiply one another times 20 y square mean y by y over 21 x squared mean x by x you don't necessarily have to do that but it's just to clarify it in case you are a bit lost so x cancels x x into x one time x into x one time all right this y cancels this y and this y cancels this y so far we have 3 over 4 y's 4 y 2 of the y's are gone multiplied by 20 over 21 x but we can still continue to cancel so let's look at what we have to do we we'll say 3 into 3 was one time how many trees do you have into 21 7 so it's 7 4 into 4 goes one time 4 into 20 is 5 so we're simplifying so here you have 1 over 1y which is just y 1 over y multiplied by 5 over 7x 7x I don't see anything more to cancel so I'll just multiply the two tops 5 times 1 is 5 over multiply the two bottoms y multiplied by 7x is 7xy so this is our answer 5 over 7xy